What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode here of the Minecraft. I don't even have my, my fingers on the keys. The Minecraft single player series today, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a while. It has actually been a full seven months since my last episode of the Minecraft survival series. Well, here we are. We're back. And I want to do a little talkie episode and a little bit of an explanation. And we're going to just start to... Do I have more rockets? Start to recap this series. Okay. Get get what we're going to be doing. Now, we're starting over at the Witch Hut. Okay. And it's because... It's time. It's time to move. We're going to be moving away from the village. I know, it's a little sad, you know, it's a little bit of a a sad story. Please tell me. There's still villagers alive in here? At least two. Come on. <gasps> oh boy! Okay, yes, perfect. This is actually perfect. I, I swear to God, I didn't plan this. I didn't know it was here. We're moving to this area, and you may be like, why, Justin? I want to start taking this series in a different direction. I wanted this series to be, ooh, I'm a mega builder. I'm not. I'm really not. I'm really, truly not a mega builder. So, what I wanted to start doing was maybe moving to this area and starting an underground base, kind of taking inspiration off of Etho. And I want to have a bunch of farms, different contraptions, different everything going on in this area. And I want to start to turn this world into a kind of magnificent, magnificent is the word I'm looking for, uh, creation. I've never had a single player world last this long and have it in my friggin' single player list for so long and doing videos on it's just it's been here for so long even though we barely play on it sometimes i really do want to make this series a main thing on the channel now you may be asking what what happens to if you're playing on a, a multiplayer server like nsg or if i join another one uh they're still going to be here they're still going to be here nsg is kind of in a weird weird state that i don't really want to talk about right I don't really want to discuss where NSG is, and it's okay, it's fine. Uh, everything's fine, don't worry, it's just some stuff going on. It's totally fine. But, this series will always be me and you guys, and will always be an area where we can create. So, here we are. Welcome home, this is our area. Now, there's a few other things that I want to discuss, so we, we kind of have to do a little bit of fast travel. What's up guys and welcome back to another episode here of the Minecraft single player series. Today ladies and gentlemen this video is scheduled to be released on a Friday and it is currently Tuesday which means I have a few days to record this video and try to make some progress in the world which is really what I want to do. That's how I want to start doing videos nowadays. How you? This is the first week that I've stuck to a schedule. You know, we got Monday, single player, Tuesday, uh, it's a, a server, so like right now it's the Crafting Dead. Wednesday, top five seed, or no, no, Wednesday's off. Uh, Wednesday off, <laughs> Wednesday off, Thursday, top five seed, Friday, single player, and then I'm gonna do another like seed video on Saturday probably. Uh, I just, I wanna do those a little closer together and then have these episodes spaced out so I have a little more time to work on them, which is awesome. So today, ladies and gentlemen, I do wanna show off some progress that I've made here at the new base. As you guys know, in the last episode, we discussed actually leaving the old base, or not leaving, but taking a temporary break and starting a new base with the style that I really want to do in this world. Uh, I've really been struggling with the other base. I, I'm not a builder by chance, but I'm trying to improve. So this is where we've improved. <laughs> so I found a cave and here's where things get interesting. I dug straight down in a random location and I just made a nice square room. Now the plan was to have the room be somewhat square, like this, as you can see. The room was going to be square, and I was going to have sections going off of it for the chest room. So this whole area was going to be the chest room. But when I was digging out the hole, I noticed that this cave kind of cut through. And that was the, the design we were going through for in this base. So this base is going to be as naturalistic, as like cavey and cool as we can possibly get it. So what I did was I built a side staircase. I decided to take this section of the wall and I built this staircase. I love this. This is all custom. This was all flat and I placed it. I know it's nothing huge. I know you're like, what? What do you mean? This is pff, loser. No, I'm in, I'm, I'm so happy. Don't, <laughs> don't excuse me trying to breathe and accidentally burping on camera. It's fine. It's fine. I'm not restarting this clip. I've done that twice now. I got to stop drinking root beer before, uh, <laughs> 
before I record, but what are we working on in today's episode? The one thing that I've been lacking in this world for the past 365 days, actually, what day are we on? Does it actually show? Day 1668, so what I've been lacking in the last 1000 episodes, or 1000 days in this world are, uh, what's it called? Is it is a proper chest room and I have an idea of how I want to roll with it and I have an idea with how I want it to look so I thought for this episode we would really crack down on getting the chest room but there is something that I want to start doing before we do that we need to go out to some new chunks ladies and gentlemen and you may be like why do you want new chunks what's out in new chunks I want to find some shipwrecks that may or may not hold the moss block. I want to get some 1.17 blocks in this world and all the areas that we have we've explored so we can't get them. So in the beginning of this episode I want to go for an adventure, I want to go for an exploration and I want to see if we can find ourselves some moss blocks. I think it's a good idea to head back to the base, grab a shulker box, bring some supplies and then go on our adventure. I, I want to leave this here though. Are these full? Both these are full. This is why we need a chest room. <laughs> So I want to leave that there, take some fireworks with us, we're going to need more than those, but let's head back to the old base, right? And where is it? It's over here. Let's head back to the old base and kind of figure out what we're going to bring with us on this adventure. Now there is one thing I'm trying to remember. I grabbed some stuff from the base and now we're heading out, but there is something I'm trying to remember. Back when we started playing on the snapshots... I did go and work on a pillager outpost and try to make it a temporary end farm, or a raid farm, but I never ended up doing anything with the area because I was trying to go backwards in versions and I never went back in hopes to preserve the area. Do you think I can remember how to get back there? Absolutely not. I have no idea where it was, but this is looking promising. I haven't followed this path yet and it's definitely going the right way and it definitely went far enough so this area would have been loaded in 1.17 but the snapshots so some stuff might be a little broken here but it, it should be okay I never came back so the chunks haven't been loaded since the world should not oh this is it yeah this is it so this area was loaded in 1.17 this the snapshots that is so the area could be quite broken die please but we did have this does this still work do they still spawn around this oh yes they do oh yes they do indeed so how did this thing work oh it was simple i remember this thing you go like this you just tuck them and then you just look out your windows and then they're like i want to hurt you and then they fall in here yeah i remember this and then they come down here. I had that thing set up to kill them though. Yeah, I remember building this. What a useless waste of time. Okay, so <laughs> despite that being a complete waste of uh, time and energy, uh, we, can <laughs> we can go ahead and check this area out for shipwrecks. Now there should be, yeah, there's an ocean right next door. So in theory, it would be a lot better to do this during the day where we can see the water. You know, Mr. Border Bear. Um, yeah, this might take a minute. Wait, these have loot in them, don't they? Now, I'm not sure if I loaded this in in a snapshot that had what's it called in it? Moss blocks. I could not have. I'm still flying, technically, right? Hell yeah, I am. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Snow sucks. Okay, so. I'm just gonna fly, ooh, an ocean. Wow, this would actually be a really cool area. I'm gonna go ahead and screenshot the cords to the uh, the portal, just in case we wander too far and I get lost. This is actually a really cool area though. We could definitely build an ocean monument there and do something with that area here in the future. So let's screenshot the portal and let's go for a little adventure of trying to find moss blocks. That's the only thing I wanna do at the beginning of this video is find me some moss blocks. So I just recorded a clip, realized I wasn't recording. I found a Mushroom Island. I didn't know we had a Mushroom Island here. I genuinely didn't. Uh, cool, I guess. I, it, it's so close, too. Like, that ocean monument is in these icebergs that we were just, like, looking at. And we went back to the portal. It's, like, right back here. We are not far away. That's crazy. I love it. 
So you may be able to hear my computer fans in the background because I'm rendering out the video that was released yesterday, but... What, what are you guys doing? What, what are you doing? Why, why are you doing that? What are you doing? Why? Why are you, what are you doing? <laughs> I don't understand. I decided to do some shipwrecks and both maps led to the same same treasure unfortunately I had two right one two yeah they all lead to the same place now that I look at it they're the same map there you go dolphins have something else to play with well I kind of give up I think we're gonna have to wait till 1.18 to get the moss blocks we ended up getting seven diamonds and a few hard to see we got six Six Heart of the Seas. I went through looting. I'm looking over at my other screen to make sure I have, uh, <laughs> I'm heading toward the coordinates to get back to my base. But, uh, yeah, I just, I've been out here for probably three, four hours just trying to get a moss block. I can't get one. I don't know where they are. Normally, I guess they spawn inside chests and shipwrecks. Couldn't find any there. Couldn't find any in, I couldn't find any anywhere. So, here we are. So we either wait for 1.18 or we hope we get lucky with a wandering trader. That's the only two options that we currently hold. So I guess we'll just go from there. This should eventually ring a bell too. We're pretty much at my portal right there. Sweet. Okay, here we go. So after a wildly unsuccessful exploration, <laughs> well, I guess we got a bunch of heart disease. It's kind of fine. It's kind of okay. I thought we would kick off the rest of this episode and getting a little bit of work done on the base. Now, uh, there's a few projects that I want to do. I want to start up on the storage room, but I want to do a little more planning before I get the storage room going. So this chest monster right here is definitely going to continue growing until... I don't know the end of time, basically. But... <laughs> but... We want to work on, I have a couple plans, and to start one plan, I need another plan. And to get this plan done, it'll be beneficial for the world completely, and it's going to be a giant sheep farm. Now, a giant wool farm in particular, but to get that done, we need little sheepy. We need sheep, and we need we need to go back and get some wheat and stuff like that, because I, I don't have any. But, if we take a look around, just off camera, right in this area, there should be, I don't know where they are. Uh, it's easier to find them at night. There's a thing with a bunch of torches on it. I hid a bunch of sheep. Actually, it should still be dirt because I logged out and this is not a server. So, should still be here somewhere, but I did hide a couple of sheep underground just to kind of make my life a little easier, even though I do see one right here as well. Little buddy, I think I'm going to save you too. So, I'm going to get a little pen going for the sheep. Oh, you suck. <laughs> I'm gonna get a little pen going for the sheep. Oh, you suck. Whatever. I have two hidden somewhere. And we're gonna try to start breeding them up, getting them ready to go, and maybe start roots on the sheep farm. And the sheep farm, obviously, is gonna be in the cave. Is it just me, or are sheep just completely obsessed with wheat? I walk this guy from, like, almost the taiga biome, and he's just like, yeah, no, we good. <laughs> He does not care where I'm going. Now, I haven't really decided where to put him yet. So he's going to go in here. Oh, that's safe. Ah! Ah! Sheep run! Sheep run! Sheep run! No. No sheep. It's okay. Oh, the other one made it through too. <laughs> Come on, big guys. You're going to die. You're going to die. Not in my cave! Not in my cave. How pro are you at Minecraft? You ever take on two creepers at once? I have. <laughs> okay. Oh, hi. Hi there. Okay, come on back. Uh, how about I place, place some torches in your dungeon? And... Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> okay, so, let's... Of course, the one spot that has friggin' gravel in it, I, I tend to break. Okay, I think this is where the sheep farm's actually gonna go. Seems like a decent spot to kind of toss it down. Maybe terraform back here a little bit. Where'd he go? Hey, dude. <laughs> He's like, yes, you called. <laughs> Give me the wheat. I want the wheat. Oh, man, I love sheep in this game. Come on. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Come on in. Now, what I'm gonna do is remove your little platform for you to get out at. 
and you're gonna be here forever. Sound good? Sound good. Okay, gotta get another one. Eh, away we go. So I've been doing a little work off camera. A little bit of mining off. Eat! Become sheep so I can put you in a cage. Uh, <laughs> I have been working on the, uh, the, the place though. I've been working on the, uh, the sheep farm. Now, <laughs> originally I was like, yeah, let's put the sheep in there and breed them and then let's build the sheep farm in here. Can you see how that wasn't going to work? You see how that doesn't line up? So I moved them over there and then I started building and I think I like this. I think I really like this. It's going to be more uniform than the base. I'm really realizing that this base is really picking up an ethos slab vibe and I am absolutely loving it. The fact that that is how we're kind of approaching this, I love it. I think this base is going to be probably one of the cooler bases I've ever done in Minecraft. But that being said, I need to push it over one more cell and it takes a little bit of material to actually build this thing and I have tested it to make sure it will... Uh, grow the grass so that's no problem it might not be the most efficient thing the way i have the grass place like i could probably i don't know i think this is fine i don't know seems like it's fine uh but then it just should auto shear i haven't actually tested it yet it should auto shear and then i put these up here so we can fill these up with shear so this thing never really runs out and if it does it has a refill uh like a refill station if you must but my original plan was to have five as you can see there's five and then i had a, like a wall here uh, i was gonna do five but i don't think i'm gonna do five anymore i think we're gonna do three per color and that actually puts us to 48 cells and then if we do six in a cell it leaves the sheep farm not being absolutely massive like this little section here will have 12 so then we'll need what six sections so then it won't be that large It'll be good. But no, it'll be three sections. 12, 24, 36, four, four sections. Uh, five. What? <laughs> 12, 24, 36, 48. It'll be four sections. Wow, I'm not at math. So it'll be four of these with a middle point. Yeah, that's not too big. That's not too large when it comes to like the grand farm here. But if I did it five, <laughs> yeah, I need 16 of these. <laughs> That would have been insane. <laughs> so yeah, we're good. We're good. Yeah, we're good. We're good with that. I think that'll give us enough wool of every color. Uh, now we gotta get the dyes. The dyes will be another thing that we need to achieve. And I need to figure out how to make all the dyes. Because I, I honestly don't think I ever have. But anyway, guys. Unfortunately, we're out of time for this episode. It, it, it is, uh, what? Thursday? Wednesday. Wednesday. It's Wednesday. This video is getting uploaded. Well, I guess I could keep going, but we're already at the time limit for this video anyway. So I'm going to end it and edit it and get it ready for your Friday upload. Now, next week, we'll have a different schedule. It'll have uh, a little bit of a better layout, and it'll actually mean one more video a week, but it gives me enough time to record everything and be kind of not stressing about making videos which is really where i want to be uh, as we grow this channel oh by the way i replaced this out off camera too i don't think i said that i replaced out the staircase and kind of bulked it up a little bit just so it looked uniform to the base i think it works i like it here i, I added grass <laughs> i didn't say that either but added some grass just in my off time while i wait for the sheep to be able to breed uh that's literally what i've been doing here let's see if we can breed them quick i did just breed them but maybe Oh, oh joyous. Give me more sheep. The more sheep in here, the better, because we need we need a lot. <laughs> we need 48. There you go, guys. Make babies. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We'll have 48 sheep in no time. Okay, guys. But like I said, that's all we got time for for today. If you guys are new to the channel, like I said, my name is Winnie Gaming. Uh, you guys can call me Justin. If you are new to the channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button. I appreciate it more you can ever believe. And I will see you guys in the next episode here of the Minecraft single player series. Why don't I have sound? My sound keeps breaking. What? Why? I don't understand why my sound just turns off. I have to reload the game. This makes no sense. <laughs>